Shit. Damn. Oh, I guess Nielsen dropped. Nielsen's year in music report is one of the few ways we can get a handle on the music industry revolution. This year, we reached some important milestones. In 2016, on-demand streaming has grown to 38% of total audio consumption. Streaming is now a bigger market share than digital downloads for the first time in history, even though downloads are still bringing in more money. But for the first time in more than a decade, physical albums took a larger share of album sales than they were in the previous year. That's mostly thanks to vinyl sales. Over 13 million records were sold last year, making 2016 the 11th straight year of positive growth for vinyl. Heavy hitters like Drake and Adele had the biggest years when it came to individual artists. But there's hope for the independents too. Chance the Rapper's album Coloring Book became the first streaming only to surpass 500,000 equivalent units. Chance released his album for free, and it spent 33 consecutive weeks on Billboard. It's also worth pointing out that the number one stream song of the year when taking into consideration both audio and video streams was designer's Panda. Followed by Rihanna and Drake's work. Get ready for work, 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 work. It's me, I be work, 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 work. It's me, do me, da, 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 da. Overall music consumption was up 3%. While it might feel like the industry is in upheaval, we're actually listening to more music than ever. So, how do you guys get your music? Is streaming the future? Let us know in the comments. For PMP Updates, I'm Jinx. <laughs> guys, we didn't turn that off, right? We have a switch. <laughs>